Hey guys, Weather D. We're back for more Mario Golf for the N64, and we are on the back nine with a very generous start. I mean, no wind? Excellent. But this is what I'm talking about. You see all this stuff? Yeah, I would love to hit my ball over here, but the chances of hitting a tree is quite likely, so we're going to have to play it safe. But if I were to say Mario, fight baby Mario, then go for it. Hit that ball as hard as you can. You won't, you won't have any issues there. Divots, please stop. All right, we're gonna hit this ball probably this hard. Not full power. Oh, too much power. Holy crap, that is a green edge. Game. We're going to the frickin' putter, please. Alright, when you're on the green edge like this, it kind of pays to hit it a little harder than usual. So, let's go about... Let's go about here. Eh, oh, that didn't work. If I had aimed it, holy crap, what is this hill? Remember that part? Hit it hard. Nice hard. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, my thoughts exactly. And yes, we are in first and tied with Yochi. And Koopa's still here. Because those freaking losers, Harmon and... Oh, I guess that might... might well, Ed is really being a loser. And Ken Masters, he's back. Jeez. Excellent. Alright, and the wind's not being painful this time. Good. Alright, let's, uh, hit it here. Nice shot. And we got some good fairway action here. Please don't put me on the wall. Oh, that's good. Oh, okay, let's, let's take a look at this. Look at the steep incline, or decline here. Thankfully, it's down here, but if you were to have your ball down here and the hole is up here. Oh, no, I not, wasn't done explaining the stuff game. If you, the hole is up here, like on this little flat section, and you landed your ball down here, ugh, good luck. That's a, quite a heel to traverse. So we're just going to do this. Uh, probably should have put a lot more heat on that, but look at that hill. Look at how my ball is continuing to still nice roll. On. And I'm now stuck with a very the putt. Uh, we're gonna hit it like this. And miss. Mm. <laughs> that was my bad, but at least we're gonna save par. Nice par! Like, if there's mm. anything that you can do, if you don't get, if you have, like, a really bad game of golf, saving par is, like, one of the best things to do, at least. Okay, now the wind is being silly again. This is a really weird situation, dude. This is usually a good win for fade golfers, or low fades, but right now I'm not sure if my ball is going to be doing a good job with these trees in a way, so I have to be considerate of that. Nice shot. Don't, don't hit the damn tree. Thank you. Oh god, too much speed. What is this? What is this? Oh no, this is a really weird shot. This is a really weird shot. Well, taking a risk. That's not a good. I didn't hit a tree, though. Oh my god, am I actually going to get on the green in two? Oh my god, I'm going to get on the green in two. Yes! And I get the worst putt in existence. Alright then, it's going to break far to the right here. So let's see what I need to do here. I need to obviously hit it as hard as possible. 
I really want to make this pod. Yes. Nice, eagle. I'm gonna give myself a five. Ready to go. Yeah. Love when you get eagle with Luigi. I don't know what the hell he says, but it's freaking great. So if you guys know exactly what he's saying, let me know so I can appreciate it more. Ugh, that's a good way to get things going now. Par two or par five, you get three. All right, this one looks like a very interesting one. We're gonna have to actually hit this a little lighter than usual. Like, I mean, a lot lighter. Ooh, that's a good arc. I like it, I like it, I like it. Oh, gosh. oh my god. <laughs> nice on. Skipping the cup. Oh, there was just a little less speed. That would have been, hmm. That would have been a whole one. That would have made my day. Oh well. We can we can work with this. I don't know why I hit it so damn hard, but it's in there. Alright. Well, I'm officially the leader by like five points. I'll take that. And here's where I would recommend you be very vigilant on where you're gonna be hitting your ball here. Like, it might seem like a good idea to hit the ball, or to go for a power shot and hit it here, but the rain, not a good idea, so we're just going to hit it short. I'm kind of glad I did that, because that really would have been bad. Maybe a little too short, but see how my ball's, like, distance got erased? Now we use some power. Not too much power, let's see. Man, it's hard to figure out how hard to hit this damn ball. Hmm. Let's go full power. Uh, ball? What the hell, man? Dude! Uh, that was not cool. I don't like that. Uh, I, I really do not like rain in this game. Uh, it's like I'm starting to get the Luigi bug all of a sudden. You can stop rolling. Oh, come on. Jeez. It's just telling me how crappy this uh, particular shot's gonna be. We want to hit it around here. Oh, come on! Bogey! Ugh. The, the Ouija curse. It starts. Mamma mia! <laughs> Alright, that's fair. That's fine. Damn. Not a good way to midway through this back nine at the moment. Nice, nice. At least we got some distance. Hmm, this is what I'm talking about, though, guys, with the whole fades being kind of bad at times. This is the worst kind of bad, where you have all these trees that could be potentially ruining a good shot, so... Gonna take a risk. And that risk is gonna end me. That is some pretty woodland areas. Yikes. Alright then. Gonna hit the bottom of this ball and then we're gonna hit it right around here. That's too damn hard. Wow, did I like just start sucking? Tremendous amounts of all of a sudden. Yikes. We're gonna get two bogeys in a row. This is disappointing. I feel like the I feel like the my uh competitors right now where we start off really damn good at the beginning and then just start floundering all of a sudden. Alright, let's see if we can try to save this. Nope. 
Are you kidding me? Plus two. Man. Uh, plus ultra. This is so bad. <laughs> I, I, the plus ultra, or like the super bogey music is just like... Ouch. Just imagine those uh, high key sound effects of you hitting your head with the freaking club. Just don't actually do that because it's terrible. Keep your brain in one piece. The wind is not helping me one bit. So we got the sunset and this particular three par that has a really high drop off. And the wonkiest nice green song. ever. Because look how my ball went from also over the place. And Alright, we're gonna have to hit this ball really hard then. Oh, nice. come on, man. I am getting Luigi cursed right now. I'm glad the game, like, nice recognized job. that, yes, he did the best mm. you could. Still negative six, but damn. Let's try, to, let's try that again. All right, we're gonna hit this ball over here like this. We're gonna take advantage of Luigi's fade. Nice. Hmm, very nice. That's what I'm talking about, guys. When you have a fade, whenever you have the wind blowing up to the right or to the right, you're gonna get a really good set of distance. And I get a divot. But that divot's gonna get neutralized by the wind in terms of just hitting as hard as I need to. Let's see, um... Let's hit about this. Oh god, that bounced so wrong. Nice on. And now I have a really weird shot. Flat my ass, game, come on. This is a slant. Uh. Alright, well, we're gonna have to... Gonna have to go with it here. Oh my lord. How? This is what I'm talking about, guys. These greens are not good greens. Nice These car. are like. Mm. They built it on a compost pile of kind of greens. Now I got Koopa and Bubba and Yoshi in the top four, and Kim Masters finding himself. The fish is somehow in six. Where the hell is Metal Mario? Holy crap, you're plus 12, buddy? Jeez. Oh, we are on the last hole, and it is a par five with rain and crappy wind. What a shock. May as well hit this ball hard. And I get to hit that ball real hard again. I'll take it. Excellent. Okay, that's not excellent. Oh man, this wind kind of sucks. Oh, come on. Uh, ha, ha. All right, well, at least we can make this work. We are going to be saving par at this rate, unless I find some inner, inner approaching skills at the moment. Hmm. Oh, 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 oh. Nice oh. approach. Thanks, game. We at least get par. That's all we can nice say. Par. So, mm. that was a very interesting back nine where we were kicking ass with the first nine or front nine, and then we got Eagle, and then an almost 
pole in one and then flat tired throughout the rest of the folds. Koopa gets second place on his own course. Excellent. And Yoshi, runner, or almost runners, runners up. Excellent. And Master gets fifth, and a fish gets sixth place. Who would have thunk? Great round of golf. Thank you very much. So, here's the thing when you get a gold trophy on a different course, basically, it's not always 50 points between all the courses. If you get a gold trophy on the Koopa Cup, you get 200 freaking points. And Luigi says, Luigi very is tough. Well played. Opened up our course. Holy crap, we're still not done tallying, and there is a bit of more of a multiplier. I think there, I think there's like a 1.5 course bonus here. Let's do that. We'll have to do the math. You know what to do, chop liver. So we are all done with Koopa Cup, and it was a very successful run, even though there was some very big defeats of plus three. But we'll let that slide, because we're going to be doing some more fun, painful things like Ring Shot on Koopa Park. So prepare yourself and the crazy semantics that we're going to have to be putting up with to get through that. So thanks for watching, have a great day, and adios.